Hey guys, Pope here. So tonight I want to bring you another pistol underneath this bag. Um, first off, I want to say thank you to my uncle for loaning me this pistol. I recently had showed him the video I just did on the 22 short CDM. Really enjoyed it. It was just a little short quirky video I did on a gun I found at a yard sale. And he told me that he had a 22 pistol of his own that he had owned since he was about 18 years old. My uncle is now about 65, uh, well on to his time in life. Um, so he was telling me about this and he said that I can go ahead and take it home and do a video on it. Now, the pistol is, if I'm not mistaken, and I'll, don't laugh when I pronounce this, it's a Herbert Schmidt or Schmidt. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but it is a 22 long rifle. Uh, what is it? Eight shot. 22 long rifle, eight shot pistol. And it's not in the best of condition. It is really banged up. The bluing has definitely seen a better day. I think it's really interesting because it has a German or made in Germany marking on it, serial number, and also has, this is how I found out what it was, an HS Model 11, but really nice, really old. I figure I'd go ahead and bring it here to you guys. I'm going to go ahead and clean it up for them the best that I can and then return it to him tomorrow. But I think it was really interesting because of the 22 pistol that I just uploaded to YouTube recently. Um, I believe that the trigger and the hammer were extremely heavy. I mean, extremely heavy, like no exaggeration. The Hulk himself will probably have trouble shooting that thing. But this one here, for as old as it is, um, I mean, hammer pull, real simple, right? Real simple, and I mean, of course, looking at the hammer, it has been dry fired a few times. A little bit of rust on the hammer. Again, I am gonna clean this out before I return it to him. That was part of the deal that I cleaned it for him before I did return it. Again, it's a very nice pistol. Again, for you safety gun nuts out there. Let me go ahead and it's clear. Okay. Real easy on the hammer. Now again my fingertip Okay, not a good example. Real easy on the hammer. A little heavy on the trigger. Now, for the full trigger pull, it's not as bad. I can do that in succession. But, for the CDM, if you watch my previous video, that thing was <laughs> ridiculous on the trigger pull. And for a gun that looked as good as it did and as old as it is, it was really ridiculous on it. And I wouldn't trust that in anybody's hands to save their life. This, I can understand. Um, just looking at it, I mean, it is really nice, really old. I mean, this thing has some serious weight to it. Old wooden grips. They're a little finicky. And, you know, if you can see that wiggle room, little gaps in there, whatnot. Yeah, that's like you can see the whole mechanism in there. But we'll see what we can do about that. We're not going to take anything off. We're just going to go ahead and wipe it down, make sure it's real nice and clean to the best of my extent. You know, I mean, 
It's a pretty cool pistol. If you guys know anything about this pistol or you know have any information on it or if you even own one, just uh, post it down in the comments. Let me know what you think about it and I uh, hope you guys enjoy this video a lot. And real quick, just for a comparison, I compared the CDM 22 short to my 380 LCP. I'm gonna go ahead and get that out right quick in one second. This here is my Ruger LCP 380. This is my uncle's Herbert Schmidt 22 long rifle. I mean, and so as comparison, it's a little bit more long or a little longer. In size comparison, it's a little longer than what my 380 is, but still very narrow in comparison. The grip is a little bit wider. In general, it is a much bigger gun than my 380. That's about the best I can get it there. Again, this is uh, Herbert Schmidt, 22 long rifle, uh, presuming to be made in Germany. This is like another Saturday night special. I will be returning this to him tomorrow. Um, if you know any of these markings here mean, just let me know down in the comment box. This is really, really old. I would say about from like the 1950s, 1960s, somewhere around there. Again, if you enjoy this video, please like, share, and subscribe. This is Pope, out.